why you got a 12 car garage and you only got six cars. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to iTouchApp Reviewers. In this video, I want to go over a few things, um, mostly about the fifth beta of iOS 11.1. Uh, but before that, I thought this was pretty funny. Uh, the FBI is unable to retrieve encrypted data from 6,900 devices over the last 11 months. Uh, that is just, that's awesome to see. Uh, I'm glad that Apple has stuck by their word, supposedly. I mean, it's kind of weird that the FBI is telling us that, but um, yeah, nonetheless, uh, if that's true, that's awesome. Um, keeping our data safe and uh, not giving it over to governments without proper uh, warrants and shit. So kudos to Apple for that, I guess. It feels pretty good to know that my data is safe on my phone or at least relatively safe. So uh, on to the fifth beta of iOS 11.1. Now, if you are a public beta tester, uh, there is a little thing right here that basically just says, um, that people are having issues with public beta testers. Uh, they're having issues installing it, so maybe stay off this one, but overall this beta has been great. And uh, this guy's an idiot right here um, because uh, beta four was the GM. Uh, this is the new GM. They basically just put out an emergency uh, update. That's pretty much all that this is. Uh, anyone who tells you otherwise is probably lying. Now, I don't know this for a fact. It's pretty clear that this was an emergency fix as it was only like 40 megs. So very small update. It's just an emergency fix. I think what it was for is for to fix the glitch where if you typed a new uh, emoji, one of the new ones, uh, and then you sent it in the text, it would be blank. I think it fixed that. It fixed a few other things like there were some huge JavaScript and GPS issues. Uh, if you guys were trying to use that, uh, especially on the iPhone 8s, I've heard uh, those things have been glitching out a lot while giving directions, which is a huge issue. Obviously, you need your uh, maps and stuff to work when you need them to work. You can't have that shit glitching out. So they fixed that. And uh, I think this is probably the final update, so to speak. Uh, until the GM. I'm guessing that the GM will be released either Wednesday or Thursday of this week. Uh, I think tomorrow is wishful thinking. Yeah, Wednesday or Thursday at the latest next Monday or Tuesday. But again, I'm thinking this week probably because they really do have to get this fix out for that crack exploit uh, that was uh, I made a video on last week. So uh, there is a pretty big glitch actually in iOS 11.1. Uh, and that is if you go into the calculator app right now on your phone, type in one plus two plus three plus four uh, plus five, uh, just do it kind of quick. Uh, or even not even that quick, just kind of medium speed, uh, it will give you the wrong answer every time pretty much. So uh, pretty big issue on Apple's part. They need to fix their uh, stuff there. But overall, I think 11.1 .1 is going to be an awesome update. I can't wait to get it, uh, but I will not be doing any of the betas for it. But that's all I got for this video, guys. If you liked it, hit with a big thumbs up and subscribe. I want to thank you guys. We got over 60 subscribers uh, just in the past 24 hours, which is crazy. Big thanks to you guys. This channel is growing very quickly, so got to love that. So that's all I got for this video, guys. If you liked it, hit with a big thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.